Spain's Eurofighter Typhoon fleet is undergoing a significant upgrade as part of the country's Hurricane Modernization Program. At the heart of this enhancement is the integration of the Captur E Mark I radar, a state-of-the-art active electronically scanned array radar system designed to significantly boost the aircraft's capabilities. Airbus has already begun flight tests of this new radar, which will form a key component of Spain's air combat prowess for decades to come. The Captur E radar, developed by the Euro Radar Consortium, which includes Leolago, Hanson, and Intra, is widely regarded as one of the most advanced radar systems in Western defense. Unlike traditional radars, the Captur E uses an AESA antenna, providing an extended field of view and the ability to simultaneously track multiple targets at greater distances. With a detection range of over 370 km, the radar can simultaneously track up to 40 airborne targets guiding multiple missiles, or while operating in dense, contested environments. These capabilities are crucial for air-to-air -air combat reconnaissance and precision ground strikes. Spain's integration of the Captur E Mark I into its fleet evolves both new and existing Eurofighters. The 20 new Trench 4 Eurofighter Typhoons being delivered under the Harkin program will feature the radar as part of their standard equipment. Additionally, at least five Trench 3A aircraft currently in service will also be retrofitted with the Captur E Mark I. This broad-scale adoption represents a massive leap in Spain's aerial capabilities and will allow the Spanish efforts to engage in more complex and multi-dimensional operations. The full integration of this upgrade is set to be complete in 2027, ensuring that Spain's Eurofighter fleet remains at the forefront of European defense. Eurofighter Typhoon plays a crucial role in Spain's air defense strategy. With capabilities spanning air superiority, ground attack, and reconnaissance, it is a versatile tool for Spanish efforts capable of responding to a range of threats. The Captur E radar enhances these capabilities by significantly improving situational awareness. With the integration of this radar, the Eurofighter Typhoon can detect threats much further out, track multiple adversaries simultaneously, and engage them with precision-guided weapons, including beyond range missiles. Moreover, the Typhoon's mount iron capability, boosted by advanced radar and combined with the pirate infrastructure system, positions Spain's air force to effectively counter both conventional air threats and emerging asymmetric challenges. Whether in air policing, combat air patrol, or complex interdiction operations, the Eurofighter can provide Spain with unmatched operational flexibility, enhancing its role within NATO and European Union. Spain's investment in upgrading its Eurofighter fleet with the Captur E radar positions it in a competitive stance relatively to its regional counterparts. While countries like France and Italy also maintain robust air forces with advanced fighter aircraft like the Dassault Rafale and the F-35 Lightning II, Spain's continued investment in the Eurofighter Typhoon ensures its fleet remains a formidable force in European airspace. For example, Germany is also upgrading its Eurofighters under the Quadriga program, equipping them with the Captur E Mark I radar. Similarly, the UK is developing an even more advanced version of the radar, the Captur E Mark II, 
which won't provide additional electronic warfare capabilities. However, Spain's strategic positioning within NATO, particularly its partnership with the US and other European powers, ensures that it remains a key player in both regional defense and global security initiatives. In comparison, while France operates the Rafale, which boasts advanced radar and sensor systems, its multi drone fighter is more specialized for ground attack missions. Spain's Typhoons, with their advanced radar systems and raster operational profile, maintain a broader air superiority edge, ensuring dominance across various mission types. Furthermore, Spain's commitment to the Typhoon alongside collaborative upgrades with Germany, Italy, and the UK ensures high levels of interoperability within NATO operations, a critical factor in modern air warfare. The Captor E radar system is poised to further evolve in the incoming years. While the Mark I variant already delivers a substantial increase in capability, the development of the Mark II version is underway. This future iteration will feature advanced electronic warfare features and countermeasures, enhancing the Typhoon's resilience against emerging threats, particularly from adversaries with sophisticated air defense systems. Spain's strategic investment in this upgrade highlights its commitment to maintaining a cutting-edge efforts adaptable to future combat scenarios. With the Captor E radar's advanced capabilities, Spain's Eurofighter Typhoon fleet will not only remain a crucial component of the country's air defense, but also position the nation as a key player in Europe's evolving security architecture. As part of the Harkin program, Spain is set to modernize its fleet of Eurofighter Typhoons with a highly advanced Captor E Mark I radar. This upgrade enhances the aircraft's long-range detection, multi-target tracking, and electronic warfare capabilities, making it a formidable asset in Spain's air forces. The integration of the Captor E radar alongside Spain's broader investment in the Eurofighter platform ensures that the Spanish air force remains well equipped to meet future aerial threats. When compared to its regional competitors, Spain's Typhoons are poised to remain a cutting edge of European air power, reinforcing the country's role as a key NATO member and maintaining its strategic defense capabilities for decades to come. <laughs>